Hola. Hola. Vimbra do Mandengo e dos amores que eu lá tive. Cego Caintã Não amar Não viva the bed. Cutie. See you know what abs? You got them? What's <laughs> happening people? We are at, what's the beach called Max? We're at Carcavelas Beach in Lisbon, or just outside Lisbon. Absolutely beautiful day, catching some rays. We got tunes in the background. We got sun. We got ice cream. We got each other. Yes, yeah, the mags. Ah, oh, so we're spending a day just chilling, basically. Getting our tan on. I'll show you a bit of Lisbon later. We'll catch up with some serious seafood gains on. Yes, sir. Thank you. 
18. Whoa, what's happening, peeps? I don't know, I'll turn this down a little bit. What's happening, peeps? I know what you're thinking. Uh, what the fuck's that headband? But, A, it's a temporary measure. B, I actually looks sick, so it's sweet. Alright, so, I'm gonna show you the gaff because we're in the gaff. We got back from the beach and it was burnt because we were absolute amateurs. Standard fucking. Just shut that, babe, just for a sec so we don't get you. Otherwise, you might be naked in the video. I don't want you to see a bird naked, it's not sound. Um, anyway, this is the apartment, so I'll show you from the door. Basically, you walk in, this, this is the door. You walk in that door there, right? And then you got balcony number one, I'll show you that in a minute. Balcony number two, I'll show you that in a minute. You got a bathroom there. You got a spare bedroom up there. That's for like, if you have arguments with your bird, she has to go and sleep up there. Or I have to. Whichever, depends who loses the fight. Alright, so bedroom anyway. It's just a bedroom light, but whatever, it's cool. The good thing is, look at this window. Dun 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 Let's zoom out on that shit. Talk to me. What are we saying? That's the window. Window's great, in it? How goes the window? Alright, next up, I'm going to show you balcony number one. So what to me about the Manthal Terrace? Yes sir. What are we saying? Fuck. Yes sir. Got two cute little chairs. Yeah. Sit in the morning, have your espresso. Okay, let's go check out balcony number two. Oh! Also, I've got some crazy shirts. Just to make up for the lack of personality. Lol. Balcony, wow, look at this one, man. Let's check that. Whoa. That's balcony number two, which is great also. And the final thing I'm gonna show you is uh, two toys that we got with us today, because I think they're cool, so. Here we have a Polaroid, what's it called? How do you open it? Okay, we got a Polaroid 1600. And this bad boy, check this bad boy. All right. Ba -ba -ba -ba. All right. This here is a Polaroid SX70, which is some old vintage, absolute classic piece of kit. Check this shit. All right, what do I do? Talk to me. Saying. Say about that. Let's take a picture of Joey D. What a melon. That's the shit it makes. Anyway, there you go. Yeah, so basically, these are just uh, some cameras that we thought we'd bring because where we're staying is called Alfama. And it's like a old 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 ass like just the oldest of old towns just all narrow streets like a bit of wind there but it's just narrow streets like a bit of graffiti here and there and like just authentic as fuck looking uh, buildings and restaurants and everything so just cool as fuck we're gonna take some sick pics we're gonna go out tonight get some seafood chill out keep you updated ciao what? Dream's outfit's alright. What do you reckon? Is the outfit alright? Tidy.
That is great. What? Yeah, babe. I, I don't know what it is, right? It's not kind of ice cream. Mm. What is it? That's great. This little level. Mm. It's citrusy on the bottom, isn't it? Mm. Yo people, it is our final full day in Lisbon, so just a brief little whistle stop tour. But um, we're not filling it with too much touristy shit because for me it's gonna be uh, just a chill out haul. Just, I think I'm gonna do some hauls later in the year, they're gonna be more intense doing bits, but for now I'm just spending a couple of days with the mags. Chilling out, living life at a slow pace, man. Just eating good shit and wandering about, having no agenda. Anyway, we're at a viewpoint at the top of Alfama. So I'll show you some views. Let's go. Cool, isn't it? Should we go over it? Let's get through. Excusez-moi, excusez-moi. <laughs> Rooftops and stuff, it's great. Hi, right, peeps, we need a frappuccino. I know that's like a proper shit thing to do and you should just be drinking like authentic espressos and that but sometimes you gotta have a frap in your life man. Gonna go find a Starbs. Shit, I saw him in a video. Someone said it's like such and such but a really Creepy shit version. version. Creepy version, yeah. Yeah, so yeah, so yeah, action. Action. Sound people, we're at a place called Bellum. Bellum. It's about 10 minutes in an Uber from the centre of Lisbon. Key tip, going to Lisbon, get Ubers everywhere. Because they're pretty cheap and they save you a lot of time. We walk around most of the city, but if you want to come out a little bit, Ubers are cheap. So anyway, we're here in Bellum because we're going to look at a thing called Bellum Tower, which is a tower. It's in Bellum, that's why it's called Bellum Tower. There's a bridge. Looks like San Francisco, but it's not. It's Lisbon. Let's go check Bellum Tower. It's this way. Portuguese is hola, is hello. Oi is hi. Linda is beautiful, so you can say oi Linda. 
It says hello. That means hello, beautiful. Uh, Tudo bon, which is actually spelled T U D O B E M. That means how are you? And uh, and and you would say Tudo ochimo, which means uh, I'm great or things are great. Uh, what else do you know? I think that's pretty much it, man. Saudachi means something fun as well, but I don't know. I forgot. Bellum Tower. Yeah, it's a. Uh... Mags, give us two words about the queue. Fuck that. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, people, so we arrived here. There's a big queue. And one policy of being on a holiday with Joe and Mags is we don't wait in queues. So we're just not going to go in. We're just going to look at it from the outside. You know, it looks great. Right. I can appreciate it from this side, and I can also. Imagine what the other side looks like. I just look at a pic. I feel like I've experienced enough from one side without waiting in that. You know, we got lives to live and we got pasta de nata to eat. Alright, people, as we can see, there's a castle, loads of rocks and stuff. Looks pretty boring, actually. But guess what doesn't look boring? Time out food market. So we'll have to go there and get heavily involved in flavours, mate. Flavours. And you put cheese down. Oh, you look cute like that. And then you put cheese down. Yo people, this is Time Out Market, Lisbon. Me and the Mags are about to go on a food safari. Peeps up first we got cuttlefish in black tempura, so I'm gonna check it out. What's the sauce? No idea. Can I do it with my hands? I do it with my hands. Squid, but tougher, a bit chewier. It's good though, yeah. It's good. What's happening, people? So, what we have here is a pasta di nata, which is uh, a Portuguese tart, it's a traditional Portuguese cuisine. Um, basically, it's an egg custard in filo pastry. I'm gonna give it a try, give it a whirl, mate. Usually I'm not into pastry. So it reminds me of like Greg's. Like kids in prams with like pasties on the faces and that. This is actually good. Do you know what I mean? What is that? Buzz. Yes, Yo people, so next up we have truffled potato puree with, I don't know man, the egg's been cooked at 64 degrees so I don't know if it's boiled or it's basically a half cooked egg, look how jiggly it is. Uh, we also got prosciutto and asparagus, did I say truffled potato? potato. So I don't know what to do with the yolk, what do you think we should do with the yolk? Do you think just, just should we get some yolk on going? Ah, uh, 
Oh, that looks sick, man. All right, Mags, I'm gonna feed you some. No, 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 you go first. Is it great? That's so nice. Is it? Mm. All right, talk to me. Let's get aggressive. AKA get involved. AKA eat stuff. AKA talk to me about yolk. Oh. Mm. So creamy in your mouth. Holy moly. She goes next level as well. It's the ultimate balance of everything. It's got everything in perfect quantities. Okay, I'm gonna eat. This is number four on TripAdvisor for Jalau. So I'm gonna check it out. Add to the fat gains on. Yeah, we got it. It looks nice level. I don't know what I'm trying here. Vanilla. Yeah, it's next level. I know Vanilla's playing, but I fucking love Vanilla, so... Alright, let's try the others. Banana. That is also next level. That is also next level. It tastes like... It's definitely made with actual bananas. It doesn't taste like that. You know you get that, that false banana flavour? It's not like that. It doesn't taste like artificial banana, it tastes like legit. It's, it's banana, it's 1 in 5 a day, man. Wow, that coconut's the best. Holy moly, this is life changing. Talk to me about mango. Mmm, so creamy. Oh my. Alright, we're getting involved, peeps. Over an hour. Update us on the Roshi. Okay. Update us on the Roshi. <laughs> it's great. It's great. It's great. It's nice level. That was sick. <laughs> Yo, people, so it is our final morning. We're starting it right. Some double espressos. They're great, actually. And the holiday would not be complete without an unidentified baked good. So, part of every Euro trip should be go to a bakery, get a baked good that you cannot identify, and just try it. It's part of life, innit? Experiencing new shit, man, including baked goods. Oh, it feels, oh my god, it feels sticky. Mm -hmm. Hands are stuck to it. Holy moly, check that. Give me some close-ups. Alright, I'm gonna tear. Oh, wow, it feels great. I'm not just saying this, it feels, oh, it's soft, sticky. Mmm, buttery. Mmm. It's next level shit. It's serious. I don't I don't possess the repertoire to actually describe this feel fully. That's what you want. You want leftover pastry on your hand. It's a sign that the stickiness is there. No, ah, I can't get these things. <laughs> Mmm, that's great. Hey! Oh try some? Let's do it. I'm moody head. <laughs> oh, that's uh, that's, that's thick, is it? It is. It's clean freak. Mmm. A good choice. Mm. A great choice, eh? Oh, that's good. What's it? Let's get some background in it. Come in. Yeah, it's in the world, it's in the world of you. Look at that shit, man. It's unreal. 
Yo people, this is uh, some tram cable car type thing in Lisbon and it's just scenic as fuck, man. I don't really know what it's called. It's called the Beaker... Tram 28. Beaker Isn't something. It? Oh. It's cool. Lisbon was cool. I'm ending the video here. Everything's cool. I would recommend it. See you later. Bye. Sick. Jordan Lenny is my hero!